This week on a Ronin Perspective. Man seldom questions the fact that ugliness and evil are to be found in the world. But he's never ready as to accept that life also offers unlimited beauty and potential for joy, as well as endless opportunities for pleasure. Man becomes dissatisfied with himself and placing the blame on the unalterable aspects of a hostile world. He feels comfort in his self-created hopelessness. In this way, he relieves himself of all responsibility. Dr. Leo. Many individuals prefer to view and live their lives as victims. Self-pity is an all-time high in our society and highly profitable. Individuals who choose self-pity refuse accountability. They have refused the essential reality for living life the hard way through the false self, never succeeding and in a constant stagnation and degradation of conscience and physical self. When individuals constantly play the victim, they are avoiding the consequences by living the false self. They have convinced themselves through their misery and false self that the world is to blame for the shortcomings in their personal universe. They blame the world for the hostilities that are inflicted upon them, refusing to acknowledge the essential reality and the fact that they are the author of their own story. There are no ghost writers, only the individuals and their heroes or heroines journey. For an individual who refuses their call to adventure, refuses the essential reality of their self-actualization and choose to live a life of misery and self-pity. When you refuse your call to adventure, you're refusing responsibility in the essential reality. You're refusing self-actualization and personhood. You are refusing the art of living. You allow your garden to become overgrown with weeds and thorns, placing blame upon the soil and nature for refusing you, for refusing your animosity, your selfishness, demands, and abuse. To tend the garden of your life in such a manner is to refuse the ultimate beauty and joy that can be found if you are willing to live life as a lesson learned. To grow and evolve with the unlimited beauty and joy that can be found in one's self and the garden of their personal universe. The freedom to expand their personhood through mastery of the art of living. Such beauty and joy can be found in the awakening of one's self-actualization. Our green thumbs become revitalized through self-motivating energy and will discover and learn our potential by clearing away the thorns and weeds and allowing the soil to breathe new life into our consciousness and soul. A free to hear the full Ronin perspective, make sure to check out the Monday Mindset podcast available every Monday on all streaming platforms. And to hear more Ronin perspectives, make sure to hit the like button, click the subscribe, and ring that notification bell. Stay positive, stay focused, stay true, and much